Greetings, RC model geeks. And here we are, nearly outside the shed, for part 13 of the PB Models Crescent Tornado build, as supplied by Cloud Models. Thanks, Phil. So, uh, been quite busy today. Uh, set Pete to work, something he can't dent, which is a paintbrush. And uh, Pete is basically painting bits of the fuselage that want to be black, that aren't going to be covered. So he's done things like just inside that well there. Can you explain why I've gone over? Because it doesn't look good. Yeah, I mean, look at that poor paint. Look, I mean, you've got to think you have a straight line. Nice straight line going around. And what I've told him to do <laughs> <laughs> is just paint the outside a little bit. You know, if the covering balls is up when you're covering it slightly, then it won't show because the underneath is black. So that's why he's just gone round the edge slightly of where he's meant to be painting. Well, that's his excuse anyway. Exactly. So, yeah, he's just painting the firewall now. Um... And like I said, we've done the, uh, the the well there for the uh, for the undercarriage. Now, also this morning, I've been sanding, and uh, I'm just going to flip this over, Pete, for a Do sec. All right, I've put the bottom on and rounded it, and that is seriously round. Let me tell you. Uh, so yeah, that's of course cross grain to give the, uh, the rear of the fuselage some strength. And that's all looking uh, good. And also, if we go over to here, Pete's also been painting the wheel wells black. There. He's also painted around the inside of the canopy area black. And also the servo bays black as well. Uh, and we've also sanded the... Uh, the centre section there and on the other side uh, uh, there so it just leaves the ailerons to be put on the wing and then the tips shaped because they're not going to be uh, they're not going to be flat like this uh, they are going to be rounded of course so it's coming together, isn't it, Pete? It is. Pete's using the uh, outside workshop today, as you can see. A little bit more He's room. He's got his mobile um, bench there. I've got three of these. Yeah, you've got three of them, mate. I've got a green one. One of them's a bit smelly. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> I wouldn't yeah. use that one if I were you, mate. No, I'll try not to. <laughs> not unless you've got a cold. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it is coming together. Um, I've done a lot of sanding on this fuselage uh, this morning. There's a massive pile of, uh, of sawdust out there. But, you know, you've got to do that on a slabby. And uh, and one of the reasons I was leaving that hardcore sanding till last, of course, was because of old, uh, old Rasher. Yeah, and yeah. Uh, <laughs> Give me yeah. something to paint and then you can <clears> often <throat> do the... Uh... Well, no, I mean, you can sand out all the dinks. <laughs> so... Yeah, it's coming together now, and it's looking very nice. So, uh, yeah, I mean, this uh, this partial brick shit house, I'm sure will fly, won't it, Pete? I guarantee it will. At least once. I, I guarantee it will fly at least once. Exactly. And people will see that. Yeah. Excellent. And it's getting lighter by the minute, so it won't be a heavy shit house. Not unless you've had a dump beforehand, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Not me. I <laughs> uh, gotta love it. Right. Um, I think this is going to be quite a short video today. Um, we might get the ailerons done. We might not. Is that the next bit for you, the ailerons? Um, yeah. Well, I've also got to just shape those fairing blocks oh, into yes. the yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, into the fuse as well. But uh, yeah. We're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, there won't be a video uh, tomorrow because I'm doing some car stuff. Um, and uh, uh, did we say there's going to be one on Sunday, Pete? We uh, mothering Sunday. Uh, right. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'll be out here then. <laughs> yeah. Be avoidance that will, mate. 
Um, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm, you, I'm, you tied up, mate. No, 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 I don't think I'm tied up. Well. Because we might, we'll uh, I think we might be in the final stages just before covering, I would have thought. Yeah, yeah. Maybe covering some. I doubt if we get covering Sunday, actually. No, no, no. Final it's not stages. mothering Sunday, it's covering Sunday, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it is. <laughs> Where everybody has to come and bring me covering. I'll tell her that. <laughs> oh, right. Uh, yeah, OK. Um, I think we'll call it um, a, a day on this video. Only a short video today. Um, but Everyone's waiting for the covering. I know they are. I know. And do you know what? I've even filled the wood because I'm covering it. Yeah, because you know it, the marks do show through when you uh, cover with uh, film properly. So you know you want the smoothest surface you can get. I thought, I thought old uh, old Dave would have known that, wouldn't you, Pete? Well, you would have thought. You know, with his experience and all that. Far more than I. Well, exactly. So see you all. Uh, oh, don't know. Not tomorrow. Maybe the next day. Bye. Bye. Thank you for watching Captain Rob's RC Model Geeks. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to click that like button. If you want to see more of the same type of videos, don't forget you can subscribe. If you want to support us, you can use PayPal. PayPal.me forward slash RC Model Geeks. If you want to contact us, you can email us rcmodelgeeks at gmail.com We look forward to seeing you in the next video.